everyone welcome back to my channel or if this is your first time here welcome my name is Callie and this is my YouTube channel dedicated to all things nails and good vibes I am super excited to share today's video with you because today is a collab with Rachel from polish with Ray here on YouTube we're going to be sharing our top six glitter polishes for Christmas and I had a really fun time picking out these polishes it was actually really tricky because I feel like I've mentioned so many different glitter polishes this year in various videos so I wanted to try to show you guys some new ones. There are a couple repeats, but for the most part, there are some really fun things in here that I'm really excited for you to see. So if you're interested in any of these, I will do my best to link them all in the description box down below so you can check there for that information. And there is only a few days left of Nail Mist, and I can't believe it. I say that in every video now, but don't forget to subscribe for the last couple days of festive Christmas content. And also, don't forget to check out Rachel's video. Her links will be in the description box down below. Go subscribe to her channel, and let's get started with my video. Before we start, of course, I have to open today's door of my 12 Days of Beauty advent calendar from Trader Joe's. So today's door was this really cool almond cream moisturizing lip balm, and I'm really excited to try this. I've been hoping to get a lip product from this thing, so let's get started. The first two I have to show you, you might have already seen if you've been on my channel this season because I did a Zoya holiday swatch with me. I think it was the first day of Nail Miss, actually. So this one here is called Merida, and it is from the 2016 Fall Urban Grunge Collection from Zoya. This is a gorgeous evergreen scattered holographic polish. I just love the color of this one. It is so, so pretty, and it's just a really nice sparkly option for the Christmas season. I love wearing the Zoya scattered hollow polishes during the summer because you can see all of that beautiful sparkle, but they're also really nice options when you need a little bit of some sparkle in your festive season too. So this is a really great one. Formula is really good and it's just so pretty. Next we have Eclipse from Zoya's Splash Summer 2020 collection. This is a beautiful silvery iridescent glitter with a little bit of some holographic to it and it is just so, so gorgeous. I love using this one in nail art for Christmas designs and this one is really pretty to put over other colors to just add some of that snowy icy sparkle. And as you can see the base is pretty much clear so you can wear this in one to two coats for just a nice little wash of shimmer or you could put it over other polishes like I said to boost your mani a little bit so I think this one is really fun the formula is very nice it's not super thick or anything so this is a really great one to have and I have been wanting this one for a long time so I'm very happy it's in my collection now this next one is all around gorgeous. It's called Walking on Stardust and it's from the Morgan Taylor Champagne and Moonbeams collection from Holiday 2019. This is like wearing crushed rubies on your nails. The base is red and there's some red shard glitter and it is just so sparkly and glitzy. And I think this is a really nice alternative to a classic red cream for Christmas. So if you like something a little bit more sparkly and fun, then this is the polish for you. This pairs so nicely with a silver or maybe a different color cream polish that would kind of accent this really well. So this one's really versatile and it would look stunning on a variety of skin tones. So I really love this one. It's just such a fun color and fun sparkle for Christmas. Next, I actually have three from last year's China Glaze 50 Years and Counting Sesame Street Holiday Collection. This first one is called On the Nice List and all of these are mini polishes, by the way, since I did get a mini set of that collection last year. This first one is a really unique one, and as you can see, it has this really pretty red bar glitter in it, and then a little bit of some red micro glitter as well. So this one is just like painting red tinsel on your nails. I actually have a garland in my house that kind of looks like this, and I think it's so, so cute for Christmas. It also kind of reminds me of candy canes, so I think this would be really fun to put over a white polish. And from what I can tell, the base is pretty much clear, but I think this would make a really nice topper no matter what. It's just such a fun one and definitely a must have for Christmas nails. Nails. Next, I just had to throw in a pink option for some Christmas glitter. Also from that same collection, this one is called Gift For You. And this is a really nice, almost berry pink glitter, and it is so, so pretty. I always think of the Nutcracker when I see these kind of candy colors for Christmas. I just think they're a really nice way to change it up from the red and green. And as you can see, this one has a really nice mix of glitter to it, and the base, again, looks pretty much clear. So this would be a really fun one to sponge on your nails, or you could put this over another color, or or this would be a really good one for a glitter gradient too. I think that would look really pretty. So I really like this one and I would love to fit in some nail art with this before Christmas comes. 
The final polish I have to show you is a really fun one. It's called hashtag this is my street once again from that same collection and this one is I don't have anything else like this in my collection. I know I've said that so much lately but I didn't remember this one from this collection and it is sort of like a holographic multicolored glitter but it has this really interesting like reflective quality to it. It reminds me of that kind of like bokeh nail art. I think it looks so interesting. And I would love to use this one for a glitter placement manicure. I think that would be really pretty, but I don't know. I just thought this was a cool one. I would love to add this to a red or green manicure. I think that would look really fun. And this is just a really nice, interesting one to add to your next holiday mani. So that is it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it. I had a great time kind of grabbing some more unique glitter polishes for this video. Let me know in the comments which of these was your favorite and don't forget to check out Rachel's video as well. Like I said, all of her links will be in the description box down below as well as links to these polishes if I can find them and if I can't, maybe I'll link something similar just in case you're interested. All of that info is down below. And also, like I always say at the end of my nail polish picks videos, if you want to continue building your dream collection just like this by choosing polishes you'll love. I released an ebook this year on that very topic, so you can check that out right at the top of my description box. Once again, don't forget to subscribe for the final days of Nail Miss here on my channel. I've been posting a new video every day until Christmas, and it's been such a joy spending the holiday season with you. I have a couple more exciting videos planned, and I can't wait to share them with you, so stay tuned, and I will see you back here again very soon for another video, same nail time, same nail channel. I hope you're having a wonderful day and an even more wonderful holiday season. Bye. Oh, Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. Sleep.